This is Moniru John Muni, a PhD candidate at the University of Toronto, working under the supervision of Professor Osang Kwan. My PhD research topic is about the real-time aeroelastic hybrid simulation of a base pivoting model building in a wind tunnel. The wind is one of the most critical loads for flexible high-rise building and longer span bridges. We can see the devastating effect of wind on a suspension bridge. The bridge was subjected to wind and become unstable and finally collapsed. Similarly, when a flexible high-rise building is subjected to wind, the vibration of the building happens. The vibration amplitude depends on the frequency and the inertia of the building and the aerodynamic force. When the frequency of the building and the aerodynamic force close to each other, vibration amplitude increases significantly. We can estimate the vibration amplitude by performing aeroelastic wind tunnel test. Two types of wind tunnel tests are performed to evaluate the aeroelastic effect of the flexible high-rise building. One is called a fully aeroelastic test and another one is called a partially aeroelastic test or base pivoting model building. The fully aeroelastic test is time consuming and very expensive. So it is rarely used in the wind tunnel industry. On the other hand, in the base pivoting model test, it is not easy to match the dynamic properties of the model building with the prototype building by maintaining the dynamic similarity law. Since the dynamic properties are tuned manually, it is not easy to match the mass moment of inertia of the model to the prototype. Besides, it is difficult to assign different mass moment of inertia in two translation directions. It is also difficult to use this method for the building which has passive damping device. In my research, I am developing a real-time aeroelastic hybrid simulation method to resolve these issues. In this method, the wind force is measured from the wind tunnel and the dynamic properties such as mass, spring and damping coefficients are defined numerically. The equation of motion is solved numerically for real-time simulations. Recently, I performed real-time aeroelastic hybrid simulation in an industrial wind tunnel testing facility for crosswind direction and validate the test method. After the successful completion of this research, it can be used for building with passive damper too. The research result will save time and cost for running aeroelastic wind tunnel tests of high-rise buildings, which will ultimately allow more accurate assessment of dynamic response of high-rise building, optimize the design of high-rise building, and ensure human comfort. Thank you.